Okay, this is just a quick screencast to show how to work around some of the bugs uh, that are currently in the Codename One uh, library code for, for building uh, Codename One projects that include a library that has a native uh, component. Uh, so I'm just going to start a new project here. I'm going to call it Socket Test Three. Native, native, uh, native theme, hello world manual. Just so that you can see we've got a, uh, a clean start. And now I'm going to go and download the CN1 socket library. Uh, it's on GitHub. CN1 sockets. And then download link just right here okay well it's uh, you can see I've downloaded it a few times here Finder. and I'm gonna copy this into my libraries folder so I'm gonna click on files and this project way down here socket test 3 and in my lib directory and I'm just gonna go oh, well, let me paste so I'm gonna go show and finder here so I can actually go into the folder and there it will let me paste okay so so it won't so I'm just gonna drag it here and I'm going to rename it so it doesn't have this silly bracket. And so now we have cn1sockets.cn1lib. So I'm going to go back into NetBeans. And I can see it now inside my lib directory. I should be able to expand it and see all of the neat things that are inside it. Now I'm going to go back into my Projects tab and right-click on the project and select refresh libs and this is going to take all the stuff that was in my uh, CN1 lib and it should put them inside uh, a different directory so if I go back into files uh, if I go back into lib impla it should show me inside CLS that my files have been installed so here it's in the ca.weblight.codename1.net you can see all the uh, classes have been installed. Now this uh, lib impl cls directory uh, is in the class path when you run the, the project. So it should be available now when we start trying to work with it. So let's uh, open uh, up our main file, source, my application. So we got our application, let's just go into the start method. And I'm going to just put something here that, so I can test to make sure it's being loaded. So if socket is supported, now this little system out print line, actually better to do it the right way because that's not going to work on a device. I'm just going to do this. Socket is supported. Else. Not supported. So all I want to do is test to make sure that uh, the sockets are loaded correctly and that they're supported. Now it gives me this little thing here because I haven't imported it and it should show up with an option ca.weblight.codename1.net, the, the proper one. There are other socket libraries, you need to make sure you're using this one. In this case, this is for the CN1 sockets library. And uh, the log class also needs to be imported. So we should be good here. So let's run this in the simulator. So I'll click run. And what we're going to see here is that it shows initially that socket is not supported. This is because there's a, a bug right now. So if I look in here, it says class not found exception native socket impl. 
That's just because there's uh, currently a bug in the Codename 1 build scripts uh, to do with uh, uh, Codename 1 libraries uh, that uh, the first time you build it, it doesn't actually package everything up yet. It doesn't package it until after the jar step, which it doesn't do for the regular run. So uh, the way to get around this is do a clean build. Is this still in the right thing? Yeah, okay. So I'm going to click on this little clean build thing. And so that actually does do the whole jar step. And now, okay, I'm going to quit this. If I run this now, there it's opening in my simulator. And it says socket is supported. And this is a bit of a pain of a workaround, but it's, you know, it is what it is. And so the step that's important is that clean and build project. Uh, also make sure before having done that, that you have done that refresh libraries, refresh libs uh, from the right click here, and also verify after having done that in files that inside your lib, impl, cls directory, everything has been properly unpacked. Now you should be good to go.